So checking the must inverter. The I bought the inverter from Must Power, Chinese company. Here is a inventor. That's five kilowatt inverter. So it's connected to the. That's a cables coming from the PV panels. So a little bit messy at the moment, as I've just installed it. Here's a uh, on grid inventor. I used to. Uh, uh, I, I was using it for a while, about five six years. This inventor was working for me. It's working. It's working now. I've connected to uh, 300 watt panels to it. It's a uh, thousand watt, one kilowatt inventor, but it's a three time inventor. You see, it's it's also working. Well, the base is nasty, nasty at the moment, so could be not enough power to power up the panels. That's why it's sometimes giving red and then switching back to grid but this this inventor is working fine so you can see I've just installed it it's working for a few days now it's all right it's good 5 kilowatt inverter good for house that's enough for house if it's not enough, it, I can always buy another one and uh, cascade them down. So it's connected. So here's a here's a cable coming from the grid. This one goes for to load. It's a on grid off grid inventor, so it can work. Uh, on grid and it can work off grid as well. It's it's very flexible, very flexible inventor. It's uh, 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 part number of the inverter, PH eighteen hundred. Uh, there are uh, different types: three kilowatt, four kilowatt, five kilowatt. That's a five kilowatt inverter. I believe there is a ten kilowatt as well. So I've connected it to the batteries temporarily as I've ordered the uh, uh, lead crystal batteries, German batteries, it's on its way. It's going to take a while to bring them here. So temporarily I've hooked up the 7 amps uh, batteries, uh, 4 batteries in parallel, total 8 batteries I got. Uh, so this is a 48 volt system. Uh, temporary I've, I've put the uh, two switches as this is not much load. But when there is a 200 amps batteries, this should be upgraded to proper 200 DC current uh, current switches. So this uh, Wi-Fi uh, Wi-Fi RQ came with uh, with this mask. I ordered it as well, but for some reason it uh, it interfering to the USB cable. It, uh, so if you see I've disconnected it. So if there is a if you if you buy one of these and connect it to the computer to PC. And here's a soft. So press it forward. Very interesting soft. As you can see, it's both the power coming from grid and the PV panels. As it's nice the weather at the moment. So this is uh, November. So it's not sunny at all. 
therefore part of the part of the power coming from the grid other part from uh, TV panels to power up, power up the load uh, here's the batteries it's fully charged batteries so I can see the parameters so that's inventor part I can switch it to charger there's a charger part for some reason the, the external temperature shows minus 51 which is wrong but um, that's okay I, I've got good support from my uh, mass team so uh, I had a problem this this software was not working properly and then I, this the reply was to disconnect the Wi-Fi and try without Wi-Fi just a USB cable so it worked but I'm currently communicating with them what about Wi-Fi how to use Wi-Fi simultaneously with uh, USB uh, Wi-Fi is good it sends data to uh, uh, to the server and I can check the parameters online using the soft for uh, Android and uh, I believe there is a same soft for uh, apples as well so here we go so that's a grid power inverter so pretty good I've been testing it for a few days so looks alright uh, it's working fine Tala.